setting controls for single pass scrub. Number one, turn your key to the on position as shown. Step number two is to set your speed control. Always turn your speed control to the zero position as demonstrated here and then start out no more than one quarter of a turn. You can adjust your speed control beyond that once you are in your cleaning application. Step number three is to set your solution control using the blue toggle switch as demonstrated here. Once solution is activated, the water on symbol will display on your LCD screen. Step number four is to set your down pressure using the black toggle switch. Note, always start with low scrub pressure. Notice that your scrub pressure will always have two indicators on the LCD as shown. Step number five, lower your scrub head as demonstrated here. Step number six is to lower your squeegee by moving the squeegee lever from the left to the right, as shown. Step number seven is to activate your scrub buttons as demonstrated here, and you are ready to begin your cleaning operation. Always remember to ensure safety to position wet floor signs throughout your scrubbing area whenever you are operating your Magnum Auto Scrubber. Your Magnum Auto Scrubber will clean between 26,000 to 34,000 square feet per hour based on the model of the Magnum Scrubber you have. double scrub application. In heavy soil load applications, leaving the cleaning solution on the floor is the best method for heavy soil load environments. The operation for the double scrub process is the same as the single scrub process, except the squeegee is left in the up position for the first scrub pass, and then lowered for solution recovery on the second pass, as demonstrated here.